Hey guys, welcome back to the Medbros channel. So I thought I'd start out my videos with uh, a week vlog to show you guys my first week of internal medicine rotation. So for those of you guys that don't know, rotations are, our school does it by month, but every month you follow a different uh, aspect of medicine. So I just followed uh, a psychiatrist. I had like two preceptors, uh, which are like doctors that, that basically teach you and uh, you follow them and you do rounding, which is you uh, follow patients and you know, ask histories, physicals, etc. And then after that, I'll be doing surgery, pediatrics, uh, family practice, etc. So uh, I'm gonna take you guys through my first week. And thanks for tuning in, guys, and let's, uh, let's do this. So we are still driving. It's like a 40 minute commute for me. I should have probably gotten a, a place a little closer. I definitely wanted to take a second to thank all the people that, you know, uh, liked, subscribed to the last video uh, that have been showing up at the Instagram. Thank you guys. Uh, you guys are really, really nice. You know, thanks for all the congratulations on my score. Um, you know, I'll just be working hard to, you know, make stuff, make content that you guys will enjoy. So guys, we've arrived, but I gotta figure out where I'm going. It's the first day. Um, my school <laughs> communication is a little lacking, so I don't really exactly know where to go. Uh, they just said like third floor, find the sound room. I'm like, okay, so I'll probably be asking around. I'll let you guys know how my day goes. I don't know about carrying the camera around in there on day one. Um, I don't know how they're gonna feel about that. As I get more comfortable, I'm sure I'll be able to take you guys in there and uh, for now, I'll probably be doing like little Instagram stories. It's time to don the white coat and head in. I'm back from uh, my first day. That was a five hour day, I think, uh, eight to one. So yeah, we basically followed around two patients who were unfortunately not in a uh, very good condition. They were, there's not much we could have done for them or even taken a good history of physical. Um, I think one had like an anoxic brain um, damage and what that means is his brain didn't get oxygen for a while. He must have like, you know, gone into cardiac arrest and they couldn't resuscitate him or so. I mean, we tried to we tried to go in there and examine him the best we could and report back to our preceptor. Uh, I guess uh, part of being a third year medical student is like, man, I don't know what the heck we could have done for him. Up there, hospital's really big, so I got lost immediately. <laughs> Lucky enough, I have really, really good classmates, uh, really helpful, really nice people uh, that helped me put it all together. The plan for the rest of the day now is to uh, head home, Probably figure out what I'm gonna eat, cook something up, and uh, read up on these cases. I think I was assigned to read up about anemia and uh, sepsis. All right, guys. So I got home, changed out of those clothes. Uh, right now I'm studying for step two. Like I took step one, so I have to take step two, which is the next exam. Um, and to study for that, I'm basically just gonna read this book and do practice questions. So this book is. Step up to medicine. See, it's brand new. I haven't touched a book since I finished step one. So that's the plan today. I'm just gonna sit here for a while now. Good morning, guys. So this is day two. Day one was kind of a fail of a vlog. Sorry, there was not much content there. Uh, so I woke up, went to work, came home, and then uh, sat there and studied. And then I just kind of knocked out. Like, I, I'm no, I don't really do well when I wake up that, uh, 5 30 6 a.m so you know throughout i hopefully have been posting instagram stories and things like that so you guys know how work is going um you guys can see my hospital and things like that so hopefully i've been doing that by the time you watch this yeah so today's plan is to uh, head to work and we'll see what time i get off but i did want to go to the gym today um i feel like i'm pretty well rested now if, if it's a day i kind of didn't get sleep um i kind of don't head to the gym because I give myself that excuse <laughs> that I didn't get any sleep. We got um, breakfast here. I also have to start doing better for breakfast. So one thing I also love doing in my first year, and I'm definitely gonna continue now, is um, listening to lectures or listening to something um, on the way to on the way to work. I listened to in my first year was Pathoma. Every day I listen to Pathoma. So I'm gonna be listening to these lectures from Online Med Ed which are uh, these just lectures uh, based on more clinical things, I guess, but it still seems pretty similar to all the lectures I had in my first and second year, so I'm not 100% sure uh, 
how helpful they're gonna be. I've already washed a few uh, during my psych rotation, which I just had. I washed all the psych ones and they weren't too helpful. The key to studying in medical school is there's so many resources, you literally just have to go through them and see which ones work for you because which ones work for you are not gonna work for other people, so. The cross section of the heart. This is the muscle and this is, this is the muscle itself. This is. I so we've arrived again at the hospital and my preceptor told me today that we're meeting at nine instead of eight so i have an hour to kill so i'm gonna head over to the library um the hospital has a little library and uh, get some studying done because uh, i haven't been getting too much done i knocked out yesterday so let's go do that Hey guys, so we are in the hospital right now while the physicians get their nice uh, lounge rooms and the residents get their own lounge, the students get something like this. It's nice, it's cozy. It's kind of tiny. We don't get free sandwiches like they do, no free snacks, nothing like that. I mean, we have a fan. That's nice, I guess. So right now I'm just going to go ahead and read up on uh, patient charts and uh, what's going on with them. And I think I have like two patients to see, so. And then we're gonna go see those patients and uh, that's the fun part. That's the plan, guys. And uh, we'll see if I can show you around the hospital a little bit. So 9 to 3 o'clock I spend at the hospital compared to some of my friends that I'm talking to who are doing surgery, who are waking up at 3 a.m., seeing surgeries, having like an hour break, getting right back into surgeries. So I have it pretty easy right now, but I'm definitely learning a lot. And with the rest of my day now, I was gonna go to the gym, do a couple of errands. Like I got to pick up packages for beneath. With my gym schedule, it's not really set. So it's it's like today I got out at 3, I have time to go do it. So. It's kind of, you know, before I used to do like Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, something like that. Um, during my second semester, we had a lot of time. But now I think my plan is gonna be just whenever I get out early, hopefully I have enough time to go to the gym. Man, it seems like a majority of my vlog is gonna be just me in this car, but uh, hopefully you guys aren't getting tired of that. So the gym I go to is Anytime Fitness, and I like that because I can come here at like 9 p.m., 2 a.m., whatever. I don't really do that, but nice to know you can. Alright guys, we picked up that package for Beneath or Miss Core Beauty and uh, one of the things that makes her most happy is these packages. <laughs> to, uh, you know, she's not a very materialistic person and she's not into like too much stuff but like I think it's in our genes, it's in our blood to love free stuff. But yeah, she's not here to do these packages so what I have to do is probably pick them up because she still has her P.O. box here and uh, I've done box them on Skype for her, so so we're gonna probably do that later today. Some guy just dropped all of his Taco Bell, man. Rest in peace, bro. So I do this protein shake thing. Beneath absolutely hates it. She doesn't even like the smell of this thing. I mean, it's the one everyone, literally everyone takes. And then I also started adding this thing. And out of all places, my during my psych rotation, my preceptor loved this stuff. Um, the idea behind creatine is like you use ATP. Uh, creatine is another energy source you can use, so it's basically additional energy. And I didn't know you're supposed to even take it post-workout. Um, so I just got a call and some friends want to hang out um, last minute on a weekday, but uh, I'm pretty sure I can fit it in and uh, I'm gonna go do that and hopefully I make it in time for school tomorrow, so. Okay guys, we're back and it's Thursday and we're almost there, uh, but I definitely feel like I'm a little bit sleep deprived. It's the usual drill, gonna go see uh, patients, gonna go talk to my preceptor. I had to actually get there an hour early 
because he gave us an assignment to read about how to stage COPD when a patient comes in, determining what stage they are, how bad it is, and what the treatment is. Um, and we're gonna present that to him. So I didn't really do that last night. I kind of just, again, knocked out after doing a bunch of other things. All right, guys, so let's head to the gym. Uh, I didn't do anything <laughs> since I turned the camera off. I just watched a bunch of YouTube videos. Um, We're done with the gym. Let's go into the grocery store. See what we can find. All right, so it's really hard to vlog. I'm not used to vlogging quite yet in public. I know exactly what Court Beauty was talking about now when she first started. <coughs> um, but we just got done from the gym. Sorry, I can't give you guys too much footage of that. Really small gym, and it gets really awkward. Um, it's either Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Lucky Charms. Oh, I even like this Captain Crunch Crunch Berry. And the chocolate rice crispies, I don't see, but that's pretty much my lineup. And some milk, my roommate drinks milk, it's not really for me. Um, eggs, what else we get in this thing? Oh, it's getting heavy. Oh, and I caved in and just got fried chicken. Just cause I saw it there, it looked all right. And I'm too lazy to go home and make dinner sometimes, so it's unfortunately the uh, reality. So now I'm just looking for hot sauce for it. Yo, I've been addicted to this new Jazz Dummy song that uh, just came out. Like, literally listening to it nonstop. Hopefully, I don't get a copyright strike with this, but it's a damn good song. Like, at least for the car. <laughs> Hey guys, so I thought I'd end this vlog outside. I'm about to head to the hospital. Uh, my preceptor had another really long overnight, so he said that we can come in at 10. So that's really good. Um, so I had a little bit of a late start to my day, but I really needed that extra sleep. I've been feeling really, really sleepy lately, like I told you guys, but this will probably be the end of the vlog. Uh, that was the whole week of, you know, first week of my internal medicine rotation. I doubt we're gonna get out as early as I did this time, uh, this whole week, and uh, you know, it might get a little more intense, but for the most part, that's how my week pretty much looks as a third year medical student out on rotations. Again, thank you so much guys for watching this vlog. Thank you for everyone that uh, came from Core Beauty. I know a lot of you guys came from there. Uh, thanks for being such awesome fans and heading over here and supporting what I do, and hopefully I make things that you guys like as well. Um, I don't plan on just talking about medical medical school or school related things. Also, Shaman and Benith are gonna be heading back, so don't worry, Shaman's gonna be making videos. Benith's gonna be back, and I have a lot of videos planned, you know, to get her on this channel as well. So stay tuned, guys, it's gonna be good. So guys, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.